people are just, they're, it's gonna pique their curiosity. And for us, it did. And I cannot wait to shove this thing in my mouth. It's Thursday today and I'm Nick Green. I was scrolling on Twitter and my friend Troy, he tweeted that he got this ad for a toothbrush. But no ordinary toothbrush. <laughs> Thank you. Let it be known. It's not a regular toothbrush. Yeah, it's important that they see that tagline, the brush to end all brushing. And this was also my response. <laughs> yeah, the button that says, wait, what? So then my next thought was, if I do this video, the comments are just going to be, <laughs> it's just going to be Drew's <laughs> name. And they're yeah. going to be like, this is a Drew Gooden video. And I'm no, I've never copied a guy in my life. Never. No. Not even on April 1st of any year. I don't know. Uh, I don't know why you suddenly bring up. Why you I'm, suddenly no, bring I that just, up? Saying that, that that's just a, I'm not on April 2nd or March 15th. I'm just saying dates. There was no I reason was, I brought up. I reached out to you to make sure it was okay to make the video. And I just said, I'm doing a video on this. And you responded and said, please, can I do it with you? Please let me, let me do it, please. Oh, okay. Well, no, actually this doesn't look like let me double. Can the thing is, what we talked about before is that this thing is $150. Quite an investment. We drew straws for colors. The toothbrush looks insane. And mm -hmm. so I knew this was this was something that was going to grab you. I mean, you see something like this and you have to think that part of their business model is just the absurdity of it. You yeah. know, people are going to see it and be like, that's crazy. I kind of want to try it because it looks so crazy. You know, yeah. that like people are just there. It's going to pique their curiosity. And for us, it did. And I cannot wait to shove this thing in my mouth. We've had a lot of restraint. You know, because I think we both had ours here for a few days now, and we're just like... It's like presents under the Christmas tree for me. Mm -hmm. I haven't brushed my teeth in weeks just yeah. waiting for this. But the basic idea of this thing is that it has 20 times the bristle coverage of a normal toothbrush, and it cleans safer and faster than any other brush. Yeah, I guess 20 times more coverage because that's misleading because it's like, you could just, you could still do all that with one toothbrush. It's just this one does it all at the same time. Yeah. You know, it's not like, it's not like when I brush my teeth, I only get one tooth and I'm like, man, that's it, I guess. The thing that really drew me in is that they claim that this allows you to brush your teeth in 30 seconds. You do 15 right. seconds of this thing on the top of your mouth and mm -hmm. 15 seconds on the bottom of your mouth, which for a couple of guys like us who hate brushing our teeth, this was really I just big. Won't do it. Yeah, I don't mind brushing them, but it is it does feel like a waste of time. It's just like I'm standing here, I can't do anything else, my hands aren't free. I would love to have something that could just stay in my mouth while I get my daily t tasks done, yeah, you know, for 30 have free seconds. Hands. 30 yeah. sec I could get a lot done in 30 seconds, all right? So Think about this. You're saving a minute and a half, 3 minutes a day. If we use this thing for a year, that's 1095 minutes which is 18.25 hours. And Wait, that's... really? <laughs> We're saving eight. Oh, that's actually, that's actually, you're making Wait. the case for this. I hadn't even thought of it. 18 hours? We're basically getting like a leap year every year. That's like an extra day. This could pay for itself. One entire work day, like that's worth the money. I can't wait to shove this thing down my throat. We've gotten into the efficiency and the speed of it, but the other thing I like is that it's safer. They mentioned how safe it is. Is brushing your teeth dangerous? Uh, you're not doing it right if you're not at a risk of injury. If you haven't gone to the hospital from toothbrush related accidents and you are not brushing your teeth correctly. I wish I read into this scientific study that they did because they have a whole abstract on it. What is this, school? Leave me alone. I love the idea of clinical data and it's just it's just a bar graph with two things. <laughs> Improvement in gin gingival Ging gingivial. <laughs> People are born with 32 <laughs> teeth. <laughs> okay, thank you. So I screen recorded my buying process and I've noticed something has changed uh, for the better, but there was something kind of sneaky that they did before, kind of a red flag. When I bought one, I noticed that it still does this, but it automatically adds to your cart the three month subscription thing it's talking about. And I didn't think anything of it at first because for me, it just said $0. And I'm like, well, I don't know what this is, but it's free, so why am I gonna worry about it? 
about it. But then like very at the very bottom in grayed out text, it's like 25, in three months we're gonna charge you $25. I wish, I like how it's in grayed out text, like that money doesn't count. <laughs> yeah, um, yeah. Wait, your recurring order, you did? You did do the subscription. See, you did, they got you. They goofed they me. They got you. Did they, they goofed really? you. They're gonna charge you again in like a month this for the replacement the brushes. Worst, I got goofed on. You freaking idiot. Now, before we get ahead of ourselves, let me go manage my goddamn subscription <laughs> yeah, here real Please quick. cancel that as soon as possible. Also, log in. Did you make an account? <laughs> don't remember. I'm sure you did. Don't, don't remember that. I'm 100% I'm sure you did not make an account. No, I did not. Because I didn't make an account. Yeah. In order to cancel it, you have to like sign up with your email and now they have your email forever and they're going to send you other shit. And the only reason I was so vigilant while buying it is because I've made so many of these videos. I know all the tactics I try to, and you're brand new, you're a freaking baby. So yeah, I'm a freaking little loser. But then the other thing that happened, you said this didn't happen to you, but a few hours after I bought it, I got an email from Patrick in parentheses, simple brush. So I guess Patrick is the guy who made it, but he was like, uh, sorry, we're out of stock. Our product's so popular that we ran out of them. Maybe they just miscounted or something. I know from personal experience, like it's pretty easy to set inventory limits. Like if you know you have a hundred of something, you can set it so that when you sell a hundred, it says sold out, right? But I, I guess they don't know that, right? We'll give them the benefit yeah. of the doubt. But <laughs> even assuming that they, that was an accident, um, cause also they were like, I should also say like, oh, it's on back order. Like, thank you for your money. You're not gonna get that anytime soon. Yeah. Um, sorry, we didn't tell you sooner. But even if that was an accident, I went and checked the website that day and it wasn't reflected on the website. Like there's yeah. still, so anyone who continued to buy it, they would pretend to be like, oh, whoops, we miscounted, which is just shitty. You know, yeah, it's like, it tell sucks. me beforehand, if it's gonna be on back order, let me know, but don't take my money and then be like, oh, by the way, we don't fucking have any of these. Yeah. <laughs> so, so yeah, so I got the blue one. I got the girl you got, one, you got the boy one. Yeah, this one's got a penis. Well. Oh, this is creepy. I don't like this at all. There is less room around the teeth area that I originally like expected, I guess. Oh. When you turn it on, it like jiggles in a certain way. It's sort of, you know, jolts back and forth. How do you get the back of your molars. Oh yeah, I don't know. Okay, I will say so far, so it's $150, but you don't just get the brush. They did try to like rope us into oh, a subscription, yeah. but they got toothpaste, they got other things, a charging cable. Okay, this also looks like ass ointment. The lack of branding here, <laughs> when they've done such a deliberate job branding, and then this is just a blank yeah. white <laughs> like tube. The manual shows how to apply the toothpaste. You're supposed to sort of line the outside of it. Okay, so then there's also a light at the bottom. Like I think the light's supposed to tell you where to like shift it in your mouth. And then finally they give you a nice little little stand. Oh, is this a magnet situation? Oh, it is a magnet situation. Okay. So branding wise, not the worst. Not terrible. Yeah. It's got that like Dollar Shave Club vibe to it. Um, you know, where it feels like, all right, I got all this crap and yeah. <laughs> here I go. Okay. So should we go brush our teeth now? I guess so. Yeah. I'm feeling, feeling ready. I'm feeling nice and dirty in the mouth area. So. Oh yeah. So I just brush my teeth with my usual toothbrush. Um, this one sucks. It doesn't get, you know, get my whole mouth at once. Did you, have you ever use one of these? I've never used it. I don't know what it is. It's, you're supposed to chew it and then it like shows you all the plaque that you missed. I, it's like for kids to learn how to brush. Jenny. I don't like this. <laughs> I missed some teeth down here. I didn't do a very good job. Oral B? More like oral bad. The B stands for bad. Take out your tongue. <laughs> really red. Yeah, I'm so glad I used this. Thanks, Nick. Okay, let's see how purple my teeth are. I'm really scared. I've never done one of these. Ugh, it's very purple. It looks like Grimace just threw up in my seat. Okay, that, that doesn't look too good, actually.
All right, day one of using Simple Brush. It is simple, I'll give them that. Um, the brush part I'm less certain about. It's got a built-in timer that when it first goes off, you don't realize it right away and you forget to put it in the other part of your mouth before it starts vibrating again, but you don't mind because you're having so much fun. So Drew didn't tell me he was gonna do a super professional voiceover for his part, so I'm just gonna kind of copy him now. There was something wrong with my toothpaste and the cap didn't really have a hole in it to squeeze out. It was just fully sealed. So I had to squeeze it all out of like the main hole, I guess. I don't really know what you'd call it. You know, I have this weird feeling that you, you end up using way more toothpaste for every brush. The brush was way harder to fit in my mouth than expected, and the time spent brushing felt, like, really short. I don't think I brushed my teeth enough. I ended up using another plaque disclosing tablet to see where I was at compared to the first brush, and it kind of just looked the same. Now that I've seen Drew's footage, I realize I might just be bad at brushing my teeth because his didn't look nearly as bad as mine, but I also... I don't think a little bit of plaque is necessarily bad for your teeth, right? Day two, it is uh, way too early to be putting this vibrator in my mouth, but I will do anything for content. My mouth didn't really feel clean after a full cycle, so I popped it back in for another one. I know that kind of defeats the purpose of being able to be done in 30 seconds, but I also like when my mouth doesn't feel disgusting, so there's that. And then that night, um, pretty much more of the same. Is this too much toothpaste to use? I don't, it doesn't say how much to use, but I feel like you gotta use so much because you gotta get on every fucking, all 30 bristles. Also, random side note, did you notice the toothpaste says regenerate on it? What the fuck does that mean? Is it gonna give me more teeth? I swear to God, Nick, if my wisdom teeth grow back in because of this toothpaste, I'm gonna lose my mind. Day one brush two with my stupid ass simple brush. Again? I don't know what the deal is with the toothpaste. I wish there was sort of a way I could, maybe if I can just, oh. Mmm, time for your teeth to get clean. So you're supposed to be done with your teeth now. But it's bullshit. It doesn't feel like, doesn't feel like I even brushed my teeth. Like, my teeth don't feel like they're clean. Day three. Now I can stain my whole bathroom purple again. I'm excited about that. All right, grand reveal. Kind of looks uh, exactly the same as last time. Kind of seems like I already had a good toothbrush and Nick made me spend $150 on another one that I hate and I will never use again. <laughs> okay. <laughs> We're back. It's been four days. Yeah, I haven't heard what you think yet. You haven't heard what I think yet. We could have the same opinion. You could have opposite opinions. Uh, I don't know. I noticed your mouth is a little purple. Did you just do another? <laughs> My mouth is much more purple. Uh, yeah, a little bit. It kind of looks like maybe you had a lollipop or something. I can just tell because I'm an expert on these fucking plaque tablets now. Yeah, like, because I they, a mile away. they dye your mouth completely purple. My entire bathroom is purple. Um, I don't know if you noticed this, but I did the plaque test for my regular toothbrush and the new toothbrush and my results were exactly the same pretty much for me too like i i yeah. think i could brush with anything or not brush at all and i think it would just show up like that <laughs> so i don't know if we need to throw those results out the window and just focus more on how we felt because yeah. i i feel like my teeth got clean like it it felt like the teeth part of my mouth you know, that checked off. But the rest of my mouth still felt dirty. You can't brush your tongue. Yeah. Which for me is a big part of brushing my teeth, especially mm -hmm. in the morning. I got stank breath and I'm trying to get rid of that. So your teeth feel like you've brushed them a little bit, but then you just like go about your day dirty mouth still and i do not like that so yeah that this morning like 10 minutes ago when i finally brushed my teeth is the last time i will ever use this toothbrush i really do not <laughs> like it like i thought that it, there was a possibility but the time it's too short you finish it it's and you're a, yeah. like, there's no way. The first day I did it, I did two cycles both times because it's like, yeah, you save time, it's so quick, but then you feel like because it's so quick, mm -hmm. like it didn't do a good job. Did you feel like it got every tooth? Because I could distinctly feel my back two teeth on the top yeah. were like still had plaque on them. Yeah, I could, I could tell it was not touching any of that. And then you could, <laughs> especially like on the bottom, it doesn't go far enough. You feel like, the front and back, there's not enough pressure to actually do anything. It's also like one size fits all. I know there's two different brush 
is or whatever but like for most people it's not like they have little teeth or big yeah, teeth it's yeah. like you know maybe they have a bigger tooth here like every tooth is its own thing basically yeah. and for me my front bottom teeth are pretty small so i think that's i think it was missing those the whole time and then a huge thing i need to talk about is the toothpaste <laughs> <laughs> yeah i okay but it sounds like you have something negative to say i didn't mind the toothpaste but it is very hard to get out of the tube i also wasn't sure how much to put on am i supposed to like that's the other thing you've got this giant you've got a hundred bristles do that's i put them on every single one it's like so you're using a shit ton of toothpaste yeah but. well okay i have two things my first thing is the fact that you're supposed to use a pea-sized amount of toothpaste for your whole mouth for one toothbrush. But when you're using mm -hmm. this thing, you have to use a whole bag of peas because you're going yeah. around the whole thing. Because the toothpaste isn't going to move. So you yeah. have to put it on every single tooth. Yeah. And it's a lot of tooth. Like, <laughs> it's a lot. It's so much. And then also, I don't know if this happened for you, but the cap is, it's supposed to be like a nozzle, like a funnel thing, right? Yeah, well, at first I just took it all the way off and just squeezed it out big style, but then yeah. I realized, oh, you, there's a nozzle, but then it's really hard to squeeze out. My nozzle, the top of it, that thin thing, completely mm -hmm. sealed. Could not get any <laughs> toothpaste out of it. I squeezed really hard. I tried sticking something in there to poke it. I yeah. all tried. So I had to go big mode the whole time, which means uh -huh. that I You're was using like. using even more. I was using so much. I had to use probably five times, maybe more than that, the amount of normal toothpaste I'd use. Well, no wonder they try to get us to subscribe to toothpaste because they know we're going to run out of it in like a week. There weren't many redeeming qualities besides the fact that. I could brush my teeth really fast, but it, it mostly ended with me taking longer than normal because of the process, putting the toothpaste on and brushing twice. I felt like this could be a very big thing for me, and I just walk away not wanting to ever do it again. And the, it's so big <laughs> to get in your mouth. It's so big. I know in the morning I'm like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah, not a not a huge fan. Disappointed. I had high hopes um, after the buying experience was annoying and <laughs> the yeah. website was off putting. I really had high hopes. What are your final thoughts? On the simple brush. Um, on the simple brush, I simply hate this fucking piece of garbage, piece of trash, belongs in the trash, piece yeah. of shit. <laughs> I think I could say that I want to throw it in the trash and throw that trash into the dumpster. Have that mm -hmm. dumpster trash compacted and set it on fire. Mm -hmm. And poop on it with my poop on yeah. it with my butt. I would I would use your I would put your poop on it and then I would Yeah. Yeah, and then I, I would I fucking hate this thing. And I hope that it it manifests into some sort of being so we can go buy guns and kill it. <laughs> I know that the toothbrush isn't alive, but I wish it was alive yeah. so that we could kill it. That's how much I hate this fucking thing. Yeah. Like, I could throw it away, I could break it, but it's not gonna feel the pain that I want it to feel. Yeah, I wanna yell at it. Are you tired of wasting your life brushing, squandering your pitiful existence, spending hours and hours every day scrubbing all 32 of your stupid teeth? Three sides each. That's 96 brush surfaces. Four extras if you're counting the back of your molars, which brings us to 100 brushing surfaces you have to painstakingly brush all individually? Twice a day? Forever? Introducing Simple Brush, the best fucking way to brush your teeth. It's quick. It's fast, it saves you time, and there are no other good things about it. Make a sandwich. Argue with your significant other. Drive a car. Fall down. Never miss a moment of productivity. Get back to work. With Simple Brush. Only available at Target.